Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to the vlog. Can y'all believe that I had to pull out my winter jacket? It is so cold outside. The wind's blowing. It's in the 40s. I know I probably repeat myself on every video about how crazy it is that it's so cold here in South Carolina. Like by this time, everybody's in flip flops and shorts and you can even sit out in the sun. I mean, it is like pretty warm. It's like at least high 70s, sometimes 80s. 40 something degrees outside April the 9th. Anyway, we are still headed out today to have some fun though. I got my bags over there. Tomorrow is actually my birthday, which is Sunday, but we're gonna go ahead and celebrate today that Josh and the girls wanna take me out to eat. So we're going out to eat and I wanna go by Target. I really go into Target and that's one of my favorite stores. I'm gonna go in there and browse around just to see what I can see and just kind of check out some of their new things. Also, another thing I'm doing today is getting things for the girls' Easter baskets. I need to finish putting stuff in their Easter baskets, which y'all have already saw that video this past Monday. If you have not seen it, I will link it down below and pop a little box up so that y'all can watch what I put in the kids' Easter baskets. Um, so anyway, I need to do that. We're gonna go out and eat. I haven't decided where to eat. I get to pick since it's, when it's someone's birthday around here, we get to pick where we want to eat, and I haven't decided. I've never in my life had Panera Bread, but I've heard so many good things about it, um, so I'm considering that today. It depends on if they have indoor seating, because we want to get out and eat, so I'm going to check that on the way there to see if they have indoor seating for us to be able to get out. If not, I'm not sure where I'll pick. Y'all just come along with us to see what I pick, and I'll take y'all on a Target with me, and we'll just see what we get into this weekend. We stopped at O'Charlie's. Josh is going to run in and see what their wait time is. They don't look too crowded right now. A couple of restaurants did, but they don't. So hopefully they have room to seat us. almost six now we went out to eat at Longhorn we decided on Longhorn which I'm glad we did we got perfect seating and food was delicious um, and then I ran into Target to grab the Easter stuff real quick 
we went back home um josh wanted to bake me a birthday cake i think it wasn't last year it was the year before that he baked me a peanut butter cake y'all and it was like the best peanut butter cake i have ever had in my life so he wanted to do that again so he um and most of the girls are at home doing that i brought millie and my three oldest girls and we came back out because i wanted to run into marshall's and ulta just for a minute um i never come to this part of town and look around and i wanted to come and look for a few minutes so i've done that and i'm just going to show you while it's quiet in the car while i what i found while i was in ulta and marshall's so i'll do ulta first i found this lavender whipped shaped body butter it smells so good and it looks like it would just be like a very smooth lotion i think the sun's bad it's not really picking it up but it's just a lavender and it's tree hut i think that's the brand is that the brand tree yeah. hut i don't know if this one is or not that's tree hut are you sure mm -hmm. Okay, I almost got this. Allie picked this out. Um, she got the cotton candy body scrub. If you're looking for a scent, cotton candy I think smells the best. It smells amazing, but I really wanted the lotion kind and I could only find the body butter and lavender. I would have definitely gotten cotton candy if it had it in the body butter. And then I needed some more of these like little makeup blending brushes and this came in like a set of four. No, yeah, one, two, three, four. It came in a set of four. So I just got some of those for my foundation. And then also got this Tree Hut um, lip butter. I'm always looking for new things to put on my lips. So I got that. That looks like it'd be good. And then I just got a couple of things of Q-tips because we're all out of Q-tips and that was pretty cheap. So I just got a couple of things of those. And that's all that I got in there. All right, now in Marshalls. I know that it is springtime, y'all, but I still love my throws when I sit down in the evening. I got to have a blanket. And they actually had spring throws out. Look at this. It's so cute. I couldn't decide which one I wanted. So I just got the one with all the like bright stripes. I know some of the girls are probably going to take over this and cover up with it. Because the girls and I all love throws. Like they're the best. Josh is going to be like, did you really need another throw? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. <laughs> and then the last thing that I got in there. And it says listed out. It's just a little notepad. Um, I just figured I could leave this on the counter or the fridge and just jot notes down on it. So that's all they got at Marshalls is the blanket and the notepad. And then I got one thing in Target for myself. Other things were Easter basket goodies. So in Target, this is what I got. A little makeup bag. I just thought it was so cute. I love the white with the little black print. And I needed a new bag to put my makeup in. So I thought this was perfect to keep my makeup in. So that's all that I got. <laughs> Y'all, I was just now talking and I wasn't recording. I, I do that all the time. Anyway, I was saying that we didn't go to Panera Bread to eat, but I noticed that they had coffee. So I was like, I want to go buy Panera Bread and try one of their coffees. Because y'all know I'm like a coffee person. Love my coffees. I love to try new coffees. So anyway, we went there and they didn't have like flavored iced coffees, but you could add syrup to it. So I was like, okay, add vanilla syrup to the iced coffee. Um, y'all, it was, it was not good. I let the girls try it. It was just so bitter. It was like drinking black coffee on ice. So when I got home, I added some hazelnut creamer to it as you can tell i've still only took a couple of sips out of it because it just isn't good even with trying to add the flavor creamer to it it still wasn't good so anyway you live and you learn i like trying new coffees veneer bread definitely wasn't my favorite coffee but that's okay Here is the peanut butter cake, y'all. It looks so good. I can't wait to try it tonight. And then here is the soup that we put on this morning. It also, I just took a bite. It tastes really, really good. Happy birthday, dear mama. <laughs> she was laughing so hard. Thank you, mother. Thank you. Oh, it's melting. It's melting. Melvin. <laughs> Here you go, Allie, for the one who didn't make fun of me. Melvin. Kylie and Emma get laughed. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. You gotta get the laugh. <laughs> I'm not on that video. It is really, really, really good, delicious. You done a great job. Oh, thank you. Super, super good cake. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. I already love peanut butter. Mm -hmm. Can you share your recipe with us? Because uh, it wasn't mine. <laughs> it wasn't my recipe. 
I couldn't tell you how to do this again right now. I have to read it. I have to read the recipe. I'll link the recipe down below. For I know it's got it's peanut super, butter in it. Super good, really good cake. Got peanut butter in it. Definitely got peanut butter in it. It's got sugar in it. <laughs> Lots of sugar. Lots of sugar. <laughs> yeah, that's yours. All right, so I am now upstairs in my bathroom, and I want to show y'all what I have had my makeup in. So this has actually been in my bathroom <laughs> hanging up like this, y'all, since I had Millie. So I packed this. If y'all remember my hospital bag video, I packed this to the hospital to have Millie with all of my toiletries in it and makeup. And when I got home from the hospital, this is what i done. I literally took the hook, hung it here on this shelf, and I have been getting my makeup out of here every morning and doing it from this little bag. Right here's my sink. Here's the bag, which is not too bad, but I have missed having like a makeup bag to stick everything in. So I'm about to transfer all my makeup out into my new makeup bag that I just got. Fold this thing up and put it away because I don't need that hanging there anymore. It only took me what, almost nine months to um, transfer my makeup back over to an actual makeup bag, but hey, it's okay. I'm doing it now. This is like the perfect size for my makeup too because I don't have a ton of makeup, but I needed enough room for all of my stuff to go in here. So let's do it. Something that literally takes me, probably it's gonna take me like two minutes to get this done that I've avoided for all of these months. I literally come up here and get ready and then go downstairs. I think I have a couple of pieces over here in my drawer too. I've kind of got it spread out everywhere. I'm not gonna put this in there because I broke the lid off and it's almost gone. I need to keep that in the drawer just so it doesn't get makeup on everything else. That's my blush. I forgot to show you this from Ulta's Night too. It's just a, it's called Color Sticks. It's like an eyeshadow. Um, this is the color that I got because I kind of like the darker eyeshadows. So I'm gonna try this, see how I like it. Um, I probably. I'll probably try it in the morning for church and see if I like it or not. They had lots of colors, but I just went with that one. And there we go, y'all. That's all it took. That's literally all it took. Just a few seconds to throw all my makeup into a bag. And now I can take the toiletry bag down. For real though, y'all, this has been like the best toiletry bag ever. It's so spacious, but you can't tell it once you fold it all up. It's got so many pockets. I just love it. I got it off of Amazon a year ago. So I ordered it when I was getting ready to pack my hospital bag. So if they still even have this, I'll try to put it in my Amazon storefront. I don't even know if they still have it or not. Honestly, I'll check and see. All right, I got my side of the sink fixed over here. I've just got my new body butter over here, my perfume. This is what I use for moisturizer every single day. It's cheap, clean and clear. It works great, I love it. So I keep that on the counter and the Q-tips I just got tonight in my makeup bag with my makeup. It looks so much better in here. I keep this rack up here with my, um, that's my perfume from my old perfume. It's almost gone actually. And then I've just got some hairspray, my straightener, curling iron, and my, my hair dryer is actually downstairs. And this is just some Tresemme, um, heat protectant. And then this is just some toner and then dry shampoo, which I never use. I don't, I personally don't like dry shampoo. I got it to try and it doesn't work for me. So it's just kind of been sitting there. The girls will probably use it sometimes. Anyway, feels better to have it all fixed up and a little bit more neat and organized. 